Hello everyone, my name is Abigail Willems, but with my Kesem friends I go by Boo. You may have seen me around before. I was a part of Camp Kesem at Kentucky from our first year of being a chapter, and even as an alum they can't get rid of me. I am honored to be speaking with you all tonight about Kesem. A year ago, like I'm sure is true for everyone here tonight, I had a lot of questions. I was worried about a lot of things. I wondered if I was going to get a graduation. I wondered if I was going to get to go on my big post-college trip. I wondered if my first year of medical school was going to be in person. And when those things didn't happen, at least how I had always planned they would, I was able to move past it. But I was devastated by the thought of not having camp. The day we got the news that Kesem was moving online for the summer, I called one of the previous directors of our chapter, one of my very best friends, and just cried because I didn't think there was any way we could create the magic of camp through a screen. But just a few weeks later, I was crying with a camper parent for a very different reason. A couple of campers had moved during the year and were going to be unable to return to Kentucky's session of Camp Kesem. But when their parent found out that they could attend our Kesem at Home programming, they were beyond happy. And so was I. That phone call helped me feel a small spark of that Kesem magic again. Closer to our week of Kesem at Home programming, we sent out care packages to our campers with their t-shirts, a little Russell Stover s'mores, and of course, friendship bracelet string. We started getting these awesome pictures of our kids opening them, wearing their t-shirts, genuinely excited to be back at Kesem, even if from home. That first day of camp, I had no idea what to expect, but from that first activity, the campers and the counselors were all in they were full of that same joy I had seen in my past three years of camp. Against all odds, that magic was still there because Kesem goes beyond a campsite. For many of this chapter's leaders, they have never been to an in-person camp. For some kiddos, this summer's programming will be their first introduction to Camp Kesem. And yet each and every one of them will feel and know that Kesem magic even though the s'mores and the swimming and the mealtime camp songs are wonderful, beautiful memories, campers find their Kesem family by getting to know each other during cabin chats, by sharing their story during empowerment, and by laughing with each other, whether that's during a water balloon fight or a game of you're on mute over Zoom. Your donations tonight will ensure Kentucky's Kesem family keeps growing and that our campers get another summer of Kesem magic through Kesem at home. And for that, I thank you.